Partahelp.com. No, it's not a misprint or a duplicate. Vegas runner, three and one, again. Three days in a row puts him nine and six. That's winning about seventy-five percent a day, and in the last three days, a whopping seventy percent. My friends, my community, this is getting it done. Major getting it done. Quick note, website is undergoing changes. Told you it was going to happen. The new template comes in around June 1st. The Firefox issue is what the problem is. And it will at least redirect you back to YouTube. And you can watch, at least see the video now there. And you got it back. Hopefully the template will fix it. It's a WordPress blog. And um, they're aware of this, and it's the plugin, and the plugin's blaming it on WordPress, and WordPress, it, back and forth. Hopefully, the new template will straighten it out. At least for now, the last 10 videos I went and redid, and you can click them if you're using Firefox, however, you get directed to YouTube where the video is stored. And I know it's a hassle, but. Um, I'm really not sure what the best way to go about this is. I may just set a link when the new template comes in to all the old videos on YouTube and start from scratch. We do one every day, so there's going to actually sometimes two a day. There'll be like 700 a year or something like that of the uh, of the videos. And uh, I am actually off this weekend, so I'm going to spend some time working with it. So the site may be up, down, look a little funny. There's something going on right now looking at it. It's Some videos are duplicated and things like that. I am working on it as best I can. It is a Firefox issue, and I understand Internet Explorer sucks. It's got security risks and all that, but it works fine there. It's just Firefox is the issue, so please bear with me while I go through it. More than likely, I'm going to keep the last two weeks of videos, maybe 14, and the other ones are going to be on YouTube. There'll be a link on the site to it, and everything will work. At least for now, Firefox, you don't, the screen doesn't keep refreshing. You get redirected to YouTube, and it plays, so you can at least watch it. If you're still having problems, I know there's Safari browsers out there. <clears throat> An alternative way to see them would be YouTube.com slash ParleyHelp, although you don't get the full experience of the site. Lord knows when I bring this chat room on what's going to happen. Anyhow, just wasted three minutes of your time, but I thought that was important to clear up. Let's get to it. Get to my guys. See how we're doing for the day. Pete James, Parley Pete Sports, goes 0-2 in the NBA. 3-1 and the baseball. Coming back. Put some 3-3 three and three on the day. Like the title says, Vegas runner again. Again. Three days in a row, three and one. Did lose his best bet, but won his three two stars. You're making money with Vegas right now. Congratulations, Ace. Pride Side Investments had the Lakers, said they'd win by 16. Well, they pretty much won by like 30 or close to it. That was a 100 time play, so they are up. Easy winners, three and two in baseball, one and oh in the NBA. That puts them 4-2 on the day, but based on their star system, they are down, at least today, negative 83 dimes or dollars, depending on how you look at it. had two releases. It's almost stupid to review them because there's sides of things going out. There's a couple joke videos about him on there. You can watch them. A lot of email thought they were funny. Had the Lakers, which won. Had the Tigers on the run line, which lost. Bobby Clark Sports ends up three and two plus ninety five dollars or dimes on the day. Basher gets it done one and zero oh with a ten dime release on the Cincinnati Reds, and everything comes out back to normal. Suit Wayne Root two and two, big surprise. Frank Rosenthal seven and two on the day. You may say, well, seven and two is better than three and one. 
Frank Rizenthal is not part of my big six, so again, runner gets it. Cannon goes 2 and 0, plus 25 dimes, pulled it out. I do not care what Brandon Lang says on the site or what he does or what he preaches. He goes 1 and 1, negative 6. And spin it any way you want. That's just the reality as I get through the week right now. Two days left in the week. You got Saturday and Sunday. There's baseball, basketball, hockey starts again tomorrow night, Stanley Cup. As we stand now, Vegas runner is 14 and 6 and looking very good to be winner of the week. Although we picked two winners of the week, one on records, one on the dime system. Going by last week, not so good for Pete James because apparently being winner of the week is the kiss of death. But he has bounced back this week. He is 10 and 20 on the week. Pride side investments are 6 and 9. They're up plus 90 dimes. Good shot at them being winner of the week. Bobby Clark Sports, 15-11, plus $375 or dimes, depending on the way you rate it. I add in minus zeros. We'll figure that all out when we get the winner of the week. Basher is 5-3, and three, plus 41 dimes. Very good for him. Easy winners is 13-11, and 11, although they gave a little back yesterday. Got to give these guys credit. Plus $625. Or 62.5 dimes, depending on how you look at it and how you bet. Frank Rosenthal is 22 and 19. And this is where it gets fun. Wayne Root, 10 and 8. Guarantee you that will be 50 50 by the end of the week. Sunny Vega, apps.facebook.com slash betting on sports is 4 and 4. Michael Cannon is 5 and 8, down negative 3. And this is what I'm talking about with Lang. Regardless of the video you watch or what is said, I'm telling you these are the cold hard facts here, and you as my community need to know this. He is 2 and 8 and down negative 78 dimes. So the whole theory behind the site is giving you the handicapper information, and we run on what we call a fade system. If you faded Lang this week, you would be up major money. If you saw who was hot and who was not, you would be on Vegas Runner's coattails, and you would be 14-6 and six for the week, and you would be up well, well over 70%. They say in betting, if you can get 54 to 55%, you'll win money. That record right there is major, major, major getting it done. Again, two-star and above for Vegas Runner. Kind of got a hint from him that there might be one of his five-stars which he doesn't release that often over the weekend. And it's funny because the email I got from him as I read it basically said, sorry, this is late, really didn't like the card today, but still put basically four picks out, one three-star, two, or one three-star, three two-stars. Could you imagine if he liked the card? Whew. Look for him tomorrow. Two early baseball games. Stanley Cup playoffs tomorrow night. New website's coming. You know that. If you're using Firefox, you can actually click on the video now. It bounces you to YouTube. You can watch it. you got to go back and watch the rest. There's a couple duplicate videos in the... I'm, work, I'm doing the best I can. The traffic is overwhelming at this point. I started this just to kind of have fun with it and do it. And it is pretty much turned into about a five to six hour process per night. And that's great. Keep keep the emails coming. Keep the hits coming. Email parlayhelp at gmail.com. Apparently the web server was not ready for it. That's the email address. And that's for now. The new template is coming in June. Almost 1,000 unique views per day. This is incredible. Thank you again to all the community. Because this is your sports betting internet community. Wait till I get the chat room up. You won't have to go in the forums anymore and bitch about somebody left somebody on base, but you'll be able to type live. And as it continues, wait till you see what happens. Your sports betting internet community. Thanks for the 10 minutes daily of your time. Partyhelp.com.